Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to install Votifier on your server. Tons of people ask me, how do I install this? And now I'm going to show you how. This plugin allows you to be notified when someone votes for your server on a website. So let's say planetminecraft.com. If you add your server on there, someone votes for it. Then they'll be notified in-game and you can reward with them with something. It's really easy. First click download. Once you come to the link in the description, click download again. Hit keep. Alright, so you should have this jar file. Um, first I'm going to show the people who have a maid server not hosted by any website how to do this. So you just drag this into your plugins folder, start up your server, there you go. Alright, you should see some stuff that says Votifier and now go to your plugins folder, click and open the Votifier folder, and now you can right click and edit the config.yml. Alright, so you see this. Don't type in any numbers for this host. Now for the port, these numbers here that you see, you want to port forward this port, 8192. You want to port forward that or it's not going to work. Now I'm sure most of you, since you guys have a server, know how to port forward. So that's how it works for that. And now I'm going to show how it works for the people that have it, their servers running on a website. Alright, so this is my other server that I have running on a hosted website. So if you're one that has this too, then what you just need to do is go to files or wherever it says FTP file access. You want to click that. Then you want to log in. So put your password in and click log in. Alright, so if you're running your server on a hosted website, then you just want to find the place where it says FTP file access. Or, aka the place where you upload everything, you put your plugins in and stuff like that. So you just simply want to go in your plugins folder and you want to click upload. Okay, so you just click choose file, file to upload. You find your jar that you downloaded, Votifier, and you click submit. So upload it, you can go back now and restart your server. Alright, so after restarting your server, go into the config and click edit. Now your host should already be changed automatically to your IP. If not, just copy and paste your IP of your server. And the port, the port can stay the same. If it works for you, great. If it doesn't, then choose a number between 1,024 and 25,565. Those numbers will appear on the screen, so you just choose a port between those two numbers, any number, if this port doesn't work. So it should work. Once you're done, click save, and now I'm going to show you whether you have a home server or a hosted server online. I'm going to show you what to do next. Alright, so either for either server you have, you go into your RSA folder, and you find public key. You want to edit that or open it up. And this public key is what you're going to copy onto where you listed your server. So whatever website you listed your server on, like for mine, we're going to click update server. on. It's on Planet Minecraft. And wherever it says Votifier, you click that, enable, you type in all your information, and that key, authentication key, however you call it, your public key here is what you're going to copy onto here. So you just copy that, you type in your information, and you'll be good to go. So same thing for the uh, home main servers or whatever you call them, just copy it, and blah. Alright, so you click save after you type in all your information, and you'll be set. So now for the second part of this video we're going to talk about listeners. Listeners allow you to create a reward system for when people vote. So if someone votes you can reward them with cash, diamonds, food, whatever. If you click the link in the description, click on vote listeners, then here will be a form of a list of listeners that you can try out. So um, like this one, vote for cash listener, or a reward, reward voting or anything like that. But I'm going to do the vote for cash one, so if you click the link in the description and paste that in, it will automatically download the listener that you need. So after it's downloaded, go in your plugins folder, back to Votifier, and back to listeners. Now you just drag this into your listeners folder, and you, for the vote for cash listener, you'll also need Vault. Vault is just a plugin that manages money on your server. It's an economy plugin, so you just drag that into your plugins folder. So you should have vault and vote for cash if you want the vote for cash listener. You can find another one. 
that's fine too. Yeah, just run your server. All right, once your server is restarted, go to plugins, Votifier, and now you should see a new folder for your listener. You can go into this and edit the properties whatever way you want to. So reward, you can change that to however much cash you want to give a player when they vote for your server, and the messages and everything like that. So that's how you set up Votifier. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and I hope this video helped you out. So yeah, tell your players to vote for your server on whatever website you have it on. Alright, peace out guys.